course he's owned by yourself and the Whatever Syndicate. Um, how did that association come about with the Syndicate? Well, a good number of years ago um, I knew Ken McConnell and um, he, he was the inaugural part of the Whatever Syndicate and um, it all started from there and we Oh, we've had our ups and downs, and we've had our odds and odds and sods. Um, one or two good horses through it, but uh, this fellow by far the best. Now they're a great bunch of people, and they thoroughly enjoy um, the whole race day experience. You obviously get quite a thrill out of seeing them having such a good time. Well, I get a great thrill of anybody getting a great um, uh, time out of racing. They're, they 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 show um, everybody shows the. Uh, their excitement in different ways and they, they certainly uh, are out there. Uh, other people are a wee bit quieter but they're, they're, they, they really enjoy themselves. Now of course you, you purchased Franco Ledger from the yearling sales, what attracted you to him? I was breeding mainly, he, he wasn't a very big horse when we, very big yearling at all, he was um, quite a slight little built fellow and he's not a big horse now but uh, um, his breeding was very very nice and I like the falcons. Uh, and since then have been exceptionally good to me too. But uh, those two things, he didn't have many faults as far as everything else went, but he wasn't that big. Can I ask you, Hamish, what you had to pay for him? He was a $35,000 purchase. He uh, won his first race almost a year after he qualified, but he went on to an eight of his first ten starts. Did that surprise you? Oh, I probably did a little bit. Um, he just kept on improving. He, he'd come back and um, he just lifted with every race. and. Uh, the more we done with him, the better he got. He just, and I think that's characterised the whole racing career so far. Is that he just improves a little bit, and as we go along, we don't uh, little steps and we just keep going. So, what are some of the highlights for you of his career to date? Well, I think the uh, the cup scene this year has been a great thrill because we uh, we won cups at Central Otago, and that's where a lot of the syndicate members come from. And then we had Wacka White, which was Paul O'Neill was a big of the syndicate and um, he, he's the president of Wacker White and, and a few of the others are on the committee so that was a that was pretty good and then Wyndham well that's my old home track so that was it was great to take you know be a part of that. I'm sure Hamish you've had numerous offers for him uh, not tempted? No 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 the um, no the syndicates um, they're pretty keen to carry on and uh, yeah, um, you don't very often get a horse like this. Uh, if you're lucky to get one, so um, no, no, we're just going to carry on.